Hello everybody and welcome back to Snacko, where you join me at the beginning of, well, the end of spring, I suppose. It's going to be the beginning of summer pretty soon. I think we are on like the last two days or something. Yeah, tomorrow is the end day of, uh, of spring and then there will be the beginning of summer. Okay, so what are we doing at the moment? We are making an alembic. Ooh. Hello, it's Camellia. I'll be coming to Snacko Island to perform a set tomorrow from 4 till 9. Please drop by the event square to enjoy some live music and good vibes. See you there. I will have to try and remember that. Okay. I think I might have to start inviting some new friends sometimes as well, but uh, we also have to go and meet the restaurateur today. But we are mostly looking to make, at the moment, an Alembic. We have uh, four gold bars to go. Right, so that's all the gold bars that we need. Done. Perfect. Um, then I need quite a lot of fasteners. Quite a very lot of fasteners. So we have five fasteners and ten pieces of iron. So we're going to need still another five pieces of iron, I think. If I remember rightly, it's 20, isn't it? Yeah. So many. So what I think I'm going to do now is split these 10 in half. Put five in there. I'm going to take the four out of here and put five in there. And then I'm going to put the remaining iron ore into there. That should be plenty, hopefully, for me to get all of that done. Now, is there anything else we needed for an alembic other than the fasteners? Let's see. No, I have everything else. So we're just waiting for fasteners on that one. So in the meantime, it's raining, so we don't need to do anything with the crops today, which is fantastic. I'm going to head on into town. And we are going to check out the new restaurateur and see if we can work out how to make mushroom pasta. It's so peaceful here. No tall buildings, no small offices. I can't wait to start my new life here. All right. Let's go and check out. So I forget, Fritz, was it called? Was it Fritz, I think? I think it was Fritz. Let's go and say hi. So, wow, we're finally getting so many cool places in here. Can we go in? We can. Nice. Wow, look at this place. Oh, <laughs> let me in. <laughs> this place is so cool. Got a fridge that I shouldn't open. It would be rude. Oh, I can use their stove. Very nice. Kitchen is full of spices and sauces. It's very organized. Oh. Let's go outside and see when it's actually properly open. Obviously, we were allowed to have a look around, but I don't see the chef anywhere. The la chef. We've got this lovely row of houses now. Oh, apparently, uh, I do already have the means to make fertilizer. I was saying to chat to the comment section, like, Please let me know if I already have this because I can't see anything. Like, I can't see the wood for the trees in this. So, cultural center. Alembic recipe. And growing seasons with Nobu. Okay, well, that's. Uh... Hello. About donations? Thank you for coming to see me regarding the cultural center. You know about donations. Uh, yeah, no need to explain. Hmm, are you sure? Alright then, explain. My hope with the cultural centre is to catalogue aspects of the island, from fish to furniture to artwork to food. However, I'm only capable of organising and displaying such items. Unfortunately, I can't venture out on my own to procure some of these items myself. Which is where you come in, Sheila. I'd like you to speak with me at the counter whenever you find or create a new fish painting, furniture piece or dish. If I'm not working at the time, a donation box will serve the same purpose, sorry. So please do not hesitate to bring your new finds to the centre. 
I'll be leaving you with my personal recipe of cold noodles for your enjoyment. Please give it a try. Lovely. Okay, well, let's go and see Novu and learn about growing seasons, I guess. I don't know when. Oh, there, four till ten. Four till ten. Okay. Every day. Might be able to buy some nice food. Yummy food to take on the mines and give me stamina. Wonderbar. Okay, so I'm gonna be. Popping back to the farm to just check on how everything's doing. I'm gonna go check on my cow and my chicken. Who haven't been allowed out in a couple of days because it has been raining. So yeah, that's gonna take ages. And then we'll head over and see Nobu, I think. Is there anything else to do right now? Oh, not really, is there? I've got an egg and milk, lovely. Give everyone a brush brush. Feed them all. I'm going to need to add some more apples and things. Hold the apple, put the apple in. There we are. of gold star eggs now so that's doing really well did the milk come out gold star or just normal star don't even know where the milk went there we are the milk is just coming out normal so maybe i need a few more brushes get to know the cow a little bit better red bull red bull the cow <laughs> okay let's go see novi because uh we don't have much else to do right now uh we're just waiting for this alembic Waiting, waiting, waiting. But other than that, I could maybe catch a few fish to donate to the museum. Um, and then tomorrow I need to remember to come to the square at between 4 and 9. I know I'm going to forget. I know it, I know it, I know it. Tell me about growing seasons. Ha ha, are you here to learn about peak growing seasons? Yep. Alright Sprout, listen up. Most crops can be grown for a couple of seasons, but every crop has a peak season to ship. For example, green onions are most popular in the spring. Why? Couldn't tell ya, this is just a market data. Uh, maybe because it's got green in the name? Anyways, if you grow and ship these seasonal crops at the best time, you'll be able to make more cash. Take this as some secret advice from a seasoned farmer. Har har! Here's the promised seeds for listening to me, yap. Oh, listening to me yap even. Can't wait to see your farm grow, Sprout! All right then. Got some onion seeds, so well, that's all right. I am I getting free free seeds? I normally have to pay for those, so that's great. Okay. What other questies do we have right now? Catch a salmon. Where are we gonna get that though? I just don't know. Ship my carrots. They're not ready yet. I need to do more mining though, and we need to find out about mushroom pasta at 4pm. So I'm going to do a little bit of mining until 4pm. Might be good. Keep going. Oh, and someone said I had to look for some kind of recipe in the desert, so I'm gonna like try and keep my eyes out for that. Um, can I do stuff here? Can I like build stuff here? Outside the mines? Yeah, I can.
So I have my own little place here, which is kind of cool. So I can do, I can build a little house here if I want to do and have a tiny little uh, plot of farmland, which is pretty cool actually. I don't think there's anything saying that I have to just stick with one house, so I could totally put a little house there. I think, anyway. And, but anyway, in the meantime, let's just do some mining down here. I've not tried any fishing down here, though. Might be a thing to try. Uh, that was my bow. So far, I've had no reason to use it that much, so hoping that maybe later on there'll be some things that are a bit harder to deal with. And I'll be able to use those, so... I haven't tried redwood in the furnace yet. I kind of feel like... You don't get much of it, so I worry about... using too much. Okay, so there's definitely... We're going to need boof our way through here boof 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 oh loads of mist crystals always necessary always needed especially with the alembic coming up i have a feeling i'm probably going to use have to use a lot of these all right Onto my axe. Boof, boof, boof. Oh, nice, another elevator. I like a good second elevator. Boom, boom, boom. Lovely stuff. And then I can go over here. What about one o'clock? We're waiting for four o'clock, if you remember, for the restaurant to open. And I'm trying to collect as many mushrooms as I can in the meantime. Oh good, there's a couple here as well. I sometimes need iron ore, but I figure that what I'll probably mostly be doing is feeding this into the furnace, letting it go. Making as much iron plate as possible. And then if I need fasteners, I'll make them to order. Or maybe I'll keep a stock of 10 or 20 or so of, of those as well, because actually they are a bit of a pain to make to order, aren't they? They take ages. Ooh, lots of big mushrooms. Yay! crystals and more mist crystals through here we're getting quite a lot of iron as well which is great i think i should probably head back to the elevator once i've cleared this room though I'm just gonna avoid these guys for now in I think it was this room oh dear did I come this far uh, did I come quite far hang on am I lost no I'm not lost it's okay phew may as well grab these and then we'll head back to town by the time we get to town I very much expect a restaurant here will be open and we can go and see them lovely Right. There we go. So 
So really hoping that I'll be able to do something with this. And like I said before, uh, I do know now what I do know now what I need to do. <laughs> Can't talk today. I now know what I need to do to make a, a fertilizer box. It is a box you have to make. But like I say, I really wish the game, when it gets a bit better, when it gets a bit more developed, puts in some kind of ability to differentiate between things that you need to make because you need to use them to make things. And things that you kind of just use as cosmetics. Because I do need to know the difference between those. Right, we are very close. I want to also see Bitcherin. No, not open right now. Okay. Are you not open on a Friday? That is true. You're not open on a Friday. Okay. Let's head into Fritz's place. Hi, are you open? Hello, I am... Um... Fritz, I work in the sales department at ABC Foods. Oh, wait. Uh, no, I don't. I forgot. I'm here to open my own restaurant on the island. You should stop by when you can. I'll be open every day from 4pm to 10pm. Come relax after a hard day's work. Well, that's nice and all, but, like, you're meant to be open now. Between 4 and 10? That would be, like, now? Here we are. I'm here to buy recipes. Is the recipe what? Oh, nice. Let's have a look. Basic meals. Recipe card for basic meals. Preface with the story of one summer's meal under a gazebo. Okay. Take out. So we can have basic ramen, grilled fish. I knew that we could grill fish. Do I have, did I have to put it on a stick? Is that what it was? Probably. Gyoza dumplings and egg drop soup. Nom nom nom. Mm. Expensive though. I need to know what recipes I have from picking up that recipe card. Crafting recipes. Uh, no, it isn't. It's cooking recipes. Turnip salad, flour, cold noodles, and cheese. Is that all I got from that? Cold noodles. Oh, have I not done the recipe card? I've not done the recipe card. I've learned some new recipes. Okay, now let's look again. So now we can make bread, jelly sandwich, plain cake, cooked rice. Cold noodles, coffee, you know, we already need that. Egg drop soup, coffee, and tea. Yeah, nice. And none of those are mushroom, though. I'm gonna say that mushrooms are probably under main dishes or chef's specials. So let's try main dishes. How much money I got? I've got enough to buy one more card. Let's have a look what's in the cookbook now. Um, catfish sandwich, uh, that's a new one, Rick's chili, breakfast burger, fish tacos, tamari dragon, sushi balls. Uh, fish and tofu stew, fish and chips, fried rice, mushroom pasta, flour and any fungus. That's not too bad then. Just make sure you're using normal mushrooms. <laughs> so we could definitely try and make those. Does it make and ship for the meow task? Ship them, yeah, okay. Wonderful. So that's that's perfect. Right, so the next thing we need to do is try and get our gold potatoes on the go. And to do that, we're going to need to make ourselves a... Uh, fertilizer box. So, fertilizer box? Ah, oh, it's hard. I don't know where I make it. 
Where am I going to put it as well? I'll have to think about that. Okay. So is it under equipment? It is not. Is it under buildables? Probably. So just hiding in amongst all of the like pathways and plants and stuffed toys. Apparently there is. I've learned it though. What's that planter? It's not even in alphabetical order. It's terrible. Sprinklers. Sleeping box. Spawn seeds. Wood framing. Hardwood panel. Not there. Just look in my uh, crafting recipes. No, that's. I'm so confused. I'm sure we'd learned it. Ugh. Ugh. Definitely not there. Got a sleeping box. Grass seeds, nails, wood, panels. No. Houses. They're all houses. So no. Buildables. Fence, scarecrow, lamppost. Container. Storage container. Cutting board, counter, brick planter, tool set. Path, path, path. Plant, plant, plant. Magazine stack. Stuffed cow, barrel, basic stove. Brick pile, sack. Fake duck, rug, fake grass, lumber pile, drying rack, potted evergreen, fertilizer bag, fertilizer bag stack, and a campfire with pot. So, no. I don't know how to make this thing. <laughs> Let's go back to the carpenter, I think. I'm assuming they're open today. I don't know if they are, but. Let's see if I can get over there quickly. I think they close at like six or seven or something. Shop isn't open right now. Ah, that's all I have to say to that. Um, nine till four closed Friday. And so what is it with Fridays? Everyone's just closed on a Friday. Sucks. Okay. Where am I going to get flour? So I can, I've got wheat and apparently people are saying that I can get wheat from the grassy plains. But then how to make that into flour, I'm not certain either. I never know how to do anything in this game, I swear. <laughs> like, I'm terrible at it. It just makes me feel like I'm really bad at playing it. I don't know why. Okay, so five of those are ready. Lovely. I've got 51 new of those. And I've got five new of those. Oh, right, so we're nearly ready for our Alembic. We will actually get a tutorial on that, though, so that's wonderful. And then the rest of the iron can just go towards... In fact, I'll do two lots of iron. And then the rest of the iron can go towards... Uh, making things like sprinklers. Alright, there we are. Might need to go and chop a bit more wood in the desert area as well. I kind of feel like I want to clear up a bit of space too. What went on down here? What went on down here? What happened? What are those? What happened to them? I... 
past my wheat? Why did my wheat not grow? Or is it growing? Is that what it looks like? Am I just pulling it up for no reason? You know what, I'll leave that for now. I'm really confused. I'm gonna head to the grassy plains, so I'm really annoyed by that, because that's I need that. I need it. And I spent a lot of money on those seeds. That's like 27 seeds that seem to have just gone away. I'm sure that's the wheat. Oh, there we are. Golden grains that can be turned into flour. How? I get wheat seeds as well. Let me check out these wheat seeds then. Because, um... Oh! They only grow in summer and fall. Right, wrong, it's the wrong season planting. I didn't realise you could wrong season plant. I thought you could plant any season, but you can plant one season away that's how it works but that's fine because we can get it here thank you commenters for helping me with that and obviously i've worked out now something very important something extremely important for the game so that's fine by me right let's see if i've got anything to eat which i do Eat those wild berries. And maybe we'll chop down some trees so I can get some apples. Because apples are really useful at the moment to me. They're going to become less so as I learn how to actually make proper recipes. But now they're still important. Thank you, tree, for giving me apples. Love you too. So in a couple of days I'll be able to make some wheat. But right now, no. It kind of is all over the place around here, so. But how I'm supposed to make it into flour is still a mystery. Sad times about the wheat seeds, but yeah, at least I'm always a bit happier if I know why a thing has happened because then I can strive to not repeat that thing. We should go home and try and work out how to make this into flour, maybe. Can I put it in the furnace? Can I cook it? Make it into flour? Is it? Do I have a recipe for flour? Let's check. I do. Just put wheat into the into the oven. Okay. Well, let's see if we can make mushroom pasta. I figure I just throw the two ingredients on and. This is much better though. No knowing the recipes is just so much better because I know I know whether I'm making a mistake with the cooking, the actual process of the cooking, or whether I'm making a mistake with the actual recipe itself. So it's good to know. Uh, let's, yeah, I guess we'll need to get rid of all those eventually. I think the carrots might be ready tomorrow, which will be wonderful because I think they are for the shipping quest I have. So that'll be quite nice. All right, to my oven. Uh, oh, did I not have more wheat than that? I, I, do I really only have four pieces of wheat from all that wheat that I took apart? Really? Ouch. Okay, but anyway, let's just uh, make a proof of concept. Let's hold the wheat in our hands, place it on there, use. And I guess I can maybe place two different things. 
And then I get some flour. Lovely. I'm wondering if some of the next stoves up will stop me having to hold thing in my hand, put it in the oven, hold it in my hand, put it in the oven. I will fall asleep soon. Guess I'll finish my cooking experiment in the morning then. We are getting there. And if I did another playthrough of this, I would know so much stuff. From the from the get go that I could do that would help me so much in the game. Like such an incredible amount of stuff that you just don't know how to do. Right. Let's head outside and I'm gonna just continue oh, I'm gonna harvest my carrots. And water the one carrot that's Okay, so definitely you can And I'm supposed to be shipping these, I think, for the quest. So let's put them straight in the shipping box. Yummy carrots. Wonderful. Flower sells for 840 each. A new way to make lots of money on its way. Okay, I've got 12 potato seeds and 12 and uh yeah okay loads of seeds to plant but yeah let's get some flour in fact let's put the flour and the mushrooms next to each other these normal red shrooms cream shrooms as well in soups tastes okay common fungus Put some flour next to the red mushroom, and then we can more easily do things. Uh, oh, where is it now? Which bit of my hot bar is it? And so let's hold the shroom, place. Hold the flour, place. Use. Mushroom pasta. You just got to do that ten times. Just out of interest, I'll have to have a look at how much mushroom pasta goes for. Yeah, totally getting the hang of this now. How much do you sell that for? 390. What did the flour go for? So where the flour went for more. 276. If I can get more money for flour than I can get for... <laughs> for the mushroom pastas, you know what I'm going to be doing, don't you? Let's see. So flour is... Worth 280, and these are worth 390, and those are worth 150. 150 plus 280... Is not 390. So you're losing money between those red shrooms. 175 for those as well. So yeah, you're losing a lot of money making these things. But So you're better off selling flour. But because of the quest, I do need to sell them, sadly. So let's put them in. I need to do 10 of them by the end of this. So let's go and make the fourth one. But it's always good to have an idea for myself, like, is it going to make me more money to cook things? Especially when cooking is kind of annoying in this game at the moment. You can't really just go to something and press a button and all the cooking is done. So, yeah. Okay, 
Okay, that's my fourth mushroom pasta. So I just need another six. It should be doable. Absolutely. Alright, so I do need to head into town. Uh, we need to go and see the show today as well. I also need to water my plants because obviously they can't be watered. Um, so I would like to plant something in here where I have a... Maybe some potatoes. If I've got a sprinkler there, it should basically always have stuff planted. And I'm happy enough with the way that the sprinklers work to plant things underneath them. That's fine. Seems to be the way it works in this game. Very, very sad still about my poor, <laughs> my poor wheat seeds. That was an expensive mistake. Didn't understand how the seasons work. Understand it fully now. I was like, well, if tomatoes work, wheat should work. But wheat will work in the summer and the fall. Tomatoes will work in the spring and summer, I imagine. Which is why they are working in the spring right now. So at the end of the spring, they won't be. And it's whatever's highlighted. So whatever's highlighted, I'll show you on a seed packet now. Uh, you can see there that summer and fall are highlighted. But fall is highlighted like in gold. And that means that it will sell better in that season. The potatoes, they will grow all year. But they will sell best in spring. Onions will grow all year except for winter, but they sell best in spring. So that's my deal with those. Gonna wait a day for that to ripen before I bother replanting that bed. Got a lot of potatoes here. But I still don't have a way to fertilize them yet, so... I do have one thing of fertilizer. Maybe I should just try and see what the fertilizer rules are. I'm sure I had one bag of fertilizer somewhere. Maybe it's in my chest of drawers in here. My little storage chest. Let's have a look. We have some fertilizer. We did. So let's see if it can only be put on seeds or what the what the rules are in this game for fertilizing things. That's not what I wanted. Okay, it looks like you can fertilize things at maybe any stage there. Very nice. Oh, watering can gone. Looking forward to having several big sprinklers. And I can just I could even just sort of make Half plot of this, half a plot of that sort of thing going on. It'll be very nice. So these are my turnips. I don't know if turnips run into the summer as well. I don't have any turnip seeds to check that, but hopefully they'll... I'll soon know if they die tomorrow. <laughs> I know that the, the potatoes will be okay, and I know that the tomatoes will all be okay. So we might lose the turnips, other than that we'll be alright. Okay. Let's go to the carpenters and see if I can find the fertilizer box. I could have sworn it said that I'd got that already. But I just don't know. I'm so confused. Fertilizer box. But I, I really looked hard. <laughs> I'm not tired of this at all. No. I'll be happy when I can make it though. So let's go in. Alright, Ori is open. Perfect. So let's have a look. Crafting blueprints. No, no fertilizer box. Why am I not finding it? Like, and people are saying I've got it already as well. Oh. Certainly not there. I'm going to do my learn things, alright? So wooden storage container, software counters, lapis, a furnace, drying rack, campfire with pots. No, like... 
I'm so confused. Love being confused. Right, I will be right back. Right then, so what's it saying? Fertilizer. Crafting recipes. Used in crafting recipes. Well, I love that it tells you how to make it. It's fantastic. Well done. No, nothing. Nothing online either. It's still not at a point in this game where there's like a wiki or anything for it. Just like, why is, why does everything have to be so hard? Is there something that I could buy maybe from... I'm sure that... I'm sure that no Nobu Junior only has like cows and... It's so annoying because I've got this puzzle I need to work out and no shops are open. Gah! <laughs> and I especially thought that because people were saying in the comments, like, oh yeah, you totally already got this. See, and that I would have it. And I can't see it anywhere. And I'm almost certain I remember seeing it myself. I'm so confused. Fertilizer and string. Makes a fertilizer bag. Those are buildings. That is a sleeping box, not anything else. A bow, a rod, a sword, an alembic, a furnace. I have no idea. I mean, it might be in my alembic. If it's in my alembic, I'm going to be so cross with the people that said there was a fertilizer box. So cross. Because I was. That's why I was like trying to get the alembic. I was like, oh, maybe when I get the alembic, that'll be. That'll be when things will happen. However, I think we can make the Alembic now, so I can at least have a look in that and find out how it works, and you never know. Alright then. Alembic. It's getting done! All right, it can go a little bit further down the line. Leave a few, leave a few spaces for like furnaces and stuff. Want to rotate it, maybe? Just like there. That's a nice place for it, I think. Nice and far away from the other things. Okay. Okay, you'll be able to get fragments more easily with this. Elemental fragments can be found in the wild. Or you can break down items into their elemental components. Isn't that cool? I wish I was a great alchemist, but unfortunately I'm only, only child. Okay, I'll give you some mist crystals that I've stashed in my pockets. This sprite has pockets. You can just put any item in the left slot and a mist crystal in the right slot. One crystal per item consumed. 
that's it. It's that simple. Most places on the island have items that break down into certain elemental fragments. For example, the Desert Canyon has mostly fire fragments and Mushroom Forest has mostly water fragments. Just throw extra items into the machine and give it a try. It's a surprise. Sorry, I'll go back to my bell. Okay. The Alembic is the easiest way to get elemental fragments. You can break down anything into its elemental components. Each biome has items that are abundant in a certain element. Just plop down the items you'd like to break down in the item slot and put some mist crystals in to help break down your items. When you're close to your Alembic, you'll be able to see how many fragments are available for you to collect. Give it a few bops with your tools to speed it up. I really should be bopping things with tools to speed it up, shouldn't I? So... Just saying, fertilizer, like, fertilizer I can make with mist crystal and plant material. Hmm, I don't think this is it then. I put some mist crystals in, we'll see what goes on there then. I'll put various plant materials and things like that in see I might get water and earth out of it or something I don't know that is not helping with my with my mystery of fertilizer and it's genuinely driving me mad so I'm gonna be um, popping down to see Bituin and see if there's any more stuff that I can get from them. Just is there anything I've missed? Because I feel like there's something I've missed somewhere and it's not great. Okay, it's Saturday for Iva as well, just in case Iva had something. This is the problem, I can't go and check all the shops at once. I can't just be like, you don't have it, so I'll go and check you. You don't have it, so I'll go and check you. you no, know, you've got to go in the order of individual shops when they're open, only when they're open. This is not open. Because it's, what, Saturday? Is it Friday and Saturday you're not open? Yeah. Okay, we'll check again tomorrow. Ori is open. Wooden storage container. We've got more furnaces. A sleek fence. Cobalt. And slate. I am actually kind of interested in cobalt, yes. I'm just going to have one more look through... in a box. I just want to make a hundred percent sure that I've not missed anything here. Cutting board, sink. A mushroom bookshelf, that's so cute. I'm just learning anything that says box on it at the moment. Makes me feel better, okay? Fridge. Table, townhouse, sleep things. Sleep, sleep, sleep. Softwood. change my my look if I have a mirror storage box traditional ice box tropical things vintage things a water kettle a wooden bucket Okay, so I've learned barrel, basic stove, brick pile, brick planter, campfire with pot, burlap sack, cobblestone, concrete, drying rack, grass seed furnace. 
lapis, hardwood, wall panel, lumber pile, scarecrow, small sprinkler, sleeping box, software counter, software cutting board, sprinklers, path, tool set, wood framing, storage container. So I 100% do not have anything to make fertilizer with. It might be... I need this alchemist to open up because there was one thing in the alchemist that I couldn't buy. Which was other farming tools or something. I also want to have a quick look and see whether uh, it's something that Nobu Jr. sells. Is the shop open on a Saturday? No, it's not open on a Saturday either. Is it open on a Sunday? Wednesdays and Saturdays. Okay, that is closed. So tomorrow we will be able to go and check on all of these things and all of these shops. So like I haven't been able to get into the alchemists in two days. But in an hour's time, and I nearly forgot because I was getting so frustrated with everything else. But in an hour's time, it'll be time for our festival, won't it? So maybe I should just like stand here and chop some trees for an hour or something so I don't forget. We're always going to need wood. I'll be so happy when I do work out how to get fertilizer. It'll just be that I've not looked in the right shop or something. It'll be some really stupid reason. I need to check my barn as well, make sure I wasn't like given a fertilizer box as part of the barn or something. That would be that would be the dumbest thing ever. I'll do the uh I'll do the concert first though, because I think that's gonna be really cool to watch. I have a million other things that I want to do before we need to do the obelisk anyway, and I need to try and go somewhere that has well I'm imagining Deadwood might have a lot of fire fragments because things from the desert probably do don't they okay it said come to the square and there would be they definitely set up let me just head out and come back in just in case I need to come back into the area I can also just quickly check on my post and make sure that I've got the right day and stuff. <laughs> Love when things don't happen. Oh, it might be in the town square as well. No, it's the event square. But of course, none of these are dated, so I don't know when that was sent. Ah. Did anything go on my calendar about it? Nope. Oh, it's all there now. I had to go out and in. Wonderful. Attend Camellia's concert. The time will be 9 p.m. when you get home. I don't care about that. I just want all the shops to open tomorrow, so. Wow. Buy a drink, an energizing smoothie, citrus juice, fruit, tea or tea. Energizing smoothie. Wow, this is great vibes. Five, no, nine stars. I heard about Camellia before, but I've never heard any of her, his music live. It's completely different. It's a bit more exciting than what I'd usually listen to, but it sure is some tasty music. Oh, I love Camellia. How did you get him to come to Snapple Island? You're the bestest. I did nothing. Where is Camellia? Oh, I really like his song, Heartbeat of the Land. It's got a nice feel to it. I wish my family was here to see this. It's so cool. I've never been to a concert like this before. Nice to see you. Let's turn up the heat. Why is Camellia not there? But is there when I click on the thing? Maybe they haven't made Camellia yet. Hey, hey, this brings me back to my karaoke days. 
I'd say Kingdom That Echoes Menantia is one of my favourite songs from Camellia. Hey, 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 how is everyone feeling? I'm gonna do some dancing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh, 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 ooh. Sideways, 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 forward, backwards, forwards, backwards. Jump, 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 jump. I can't jump in time very well, though, because the jumps are a certain length. What have you got to say, Mikan? Oh, I love Camellia. How did you get him to come to Snapple Island? You're the bestest. Is that not Nobu Juniors? That's Nobu Juniors. They need to fix that. Mikan has Mikan has turned into Nobu Junior. Oh no. Okay, well I think that's everything that we can do. Unless I've missed something, but it's getting late. But that was cool. We got to go to a cool concert. I'm very happy with that. Shall we sleep? Yeah, let's sleep. Let's sleep and then maybe tomorrow we can make get some more wheat from the grassy plains. It'll give it a chance to regenerate a little bit. Slowly make more mushroom stews. Mushroom pastas, sorry. What? It's getting late on Sunday? How did that happen? That should not have happened. I missed an entire day because of that. All of a sudden it was... <laughs> I went out the door and it was nine o'clock. That's definitely, a, again, a bug to do with the... And I'm going to say outright that's a bug. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Please still be six o'clock when I come out. <laughs> that was horrible. Luckily the crops haven't completely died. The uh, turnips did. I had a feeling that they might be winter slash spring ones. It doesn't entirely surprise me. Oh, let's see what the Alembic did. It got me some nature things. Okay. Let's put in something like maybe... Let me put a mushroom in and see if we get water. I'm looking for water specifically because that's how you make sprinklers. So we'll give that a go and see how it goes. But now it's Monday so I can check the seed shop as well, so that's quite nice. I need to clear some of these beds out soon, don't I as well? them back up. I'll do a few a day. Uh, I've got plenty of empty plots at the moment. I've got any seeds at the moment as well. Yeah, 12 onions. Okay. Onion seeds are everything but winter. So they're absolutely fine to plant now. And then we'll see if we can work out this whole fertilizer malarkey. Did one of my potatoes come out uh, golden? That is the question now. But I did fertilize it, yes, and I got my, so that's my first golden potato. So that is at least the answer to half the, the quandary. Plant these as well. That's an answer to half the quandary. So half the quandary is, does fertilizer make the potatoes golden star? And the answer is yes. The second part of the quandary is, how do we make the fertilizer? So I want to go over to... Firstly, we'll start with Iva. I'm fairly certain we've been to the carpenters a couple of times now and just stuff has not worked out at all. And then we'll check out uh, the the barn and everything. Let's see if that's a thing. So let me see. You've got seeds, 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 vegetables, rice, can of beans, 
tomatoes, onions, seeds, meat cubes, eggs, milk, daikon seeds, sprinklers of various sizes, cabbage, cotton, tofu, wheat, wheat seeds, cabbage, and bell peppers. Okay, so nothing there that could be seen as like a fertilizer box or anything along those lines. So that's a definite no. So the next person that I would want to talk to at uh, 12.30 and 1 would be Nobu Jr. And also um, Nobu Jr. And also possibly uh, Bituin. So let's go and take a quick look at the barn and just make sure that part of the barn was not a fertilizer box because there's a chance that it could be coming from the animals. It would make total sense. Although that wasn't part of the recipes that I'd seen. So let's have a look. So these are these are chicken beds. That's a cow bed. That's a trough. There's an inside bell for bringing them in. And then there's the feeding apparatus. So none of that is anything to do with fertilizer. Okay, so while we're waiting for the day to run through to like 12.30 for the other shops to open up, because I've certainly not seen any way to make fertilizer anywhere else, it does look like I got some kind of interesting new crystal. I got fire and air, sadly, from the mushroom I put in. But that's good because fire is something that I need. So that's good. We'll, we'll work on that. Um, what happens if I just straight up put wood in there? Some soft wood. What do we get from that? So those mushrooms that I put in were like some sort of button mushroom, wasn't it? I forget. Right, so to the grassy plains, we want to get some more wheat. And I actually probably do want to get some more mushrooms. I don't know, I, probably, I may have enough. I need to do like another six, don't I? Four and seven, yeah, I've got plenty. It's just the wheat I need. I need another six or so. And they don't always come up every time. So I need my sword out. These ones have respawned. a lot of plant material here. Not a ton of actual wheat. Sadly. I think maybe I'll move on to a different area because I've already recently gone through that one. Might not have given it enough time to grow. Mushroom, surprisingly sweet for a mushroom. Oh, nice. Aha, one piece of wheat and a wheat seed. We can grow wheat now, though. I want it quicker than that, though. So that's two, two pieces of wheat of the six I need. We might need to have a snack. What can I snack on? I've gone through all of my apples. I've got an energizing smoothie. Why not eat that? At least it'll be doing me some good, right? Exactly. How much wheat have we got now? Three. I need three more. Here's a nice big patch. I can see why I thought it was not gettable. It was it, it can be a little bit a little bit finicky to get the wheat out of it as well. That's five. And that's six. Lovely. Let's go back home and make all the rest of the mushroom pasta. 
So out of my meow tasks now, we have managed to get ourselves... Oh, coconuts are needed, are they? Interesting. I may have a few coconuts. I've got four. I need to keep getting coconut wood, don't I? And then I'll get coconuts. So if I can get ten of those, that'll be at least something. Uh, anyway, the mushroom pastas was... I was working on the meow stuff more. So I need to mine another 50 odd times, which is probably going to happen quite happily. Ship 30 wheat. So if I just put down all the wheat seeds... I'm sad because I had that all planted. I was just ahead of myself by a few days, which is really sad. <laughs> I was too quick. Uh, so we'll work on the mushroom pastas. I will go and buy some more wheat seeds. And then we've just got to mine. Perfect. So I've got some wheat seeds already. And I've got enough money probably to get the rest of them. And... Uh, We'll just plant them all in and forget that I made that mistake. It's a bit sad though. Like I say, if I hadn't been quite so quick with everything, probably would have all been fine. If I'd have like waited until the first day of summer, I wouldn't have even had to have worried about it. And the turnips would have all died and I would have been like, oh, clearly there's a seasonal thing. Without wasting thousands. But... I had my fault for not looking closely enough. Right, so let's go in and grab some some wheat seeds. Uh, oh, I forgot to check how many I had already. So I've already got seven. So I need to get probably another 23. I should have enough for that. So let me buy those. Once they're made, that'll be everything needed for the uh, meow task. I've got all the wheat that I need. Oh, I could have bought wheat, couldn't I? Never mind. It was fun going to get it. Uh, Bitchin will be open in an hour. And I want to have a look at all the bits and bobs I can get from Bituin because there's got to be some way. Um, oh, Nobu Jr. will be open in 15 minutes though, so let's go over there instead. So I want to check Nobu Jr. Uh, because there's a chance that there might be a fertilizer box as part of the animal stuff. Let's see, add a barn. That will just directly add a barn. Buy livestock. A fluffy cow or a fluffy chicken. So, yeah. There was no, no thing about any kind of fertilizer boxes or anything there. So let's go and see Bitchwin. And see if that has any... Anything. <laughs> I can't progress without this, you see. Oh, the shop isn't open right now. I'll go out and I'll come back in at one. One, two, three, four, five, six. In we go. Right then. Let's have a little chat, you and me. What do you have? Fertilizer. Right. Okay. So if you sell the fertilizer, there's a good chance you might be able to help me make farm additives. I bet these will help you out lots on the farm. Blueprint book. Farm additives. Where is it? Oh, my inventory's full. Rats. Let me just see if I've got any new crafting recipes that look... Uh, rat. 
Pets. Never mind. Oh, you know what? Remember there was like an overflow box in my house for when things wouldn't fit? Let's just go and check that. Because it's clearly let me buy the thing. Uh, <laughs> but it, my inventory was overflowing at the time, so that's slightly annoying. But it should be, I think it should be in here. Here we are, my overflow chest. Take all. That was my fault for not having a tidy enough inventory, but thankfully the game has already thought of that. Right. I learned some new crafting recipes. Fertilizer, 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 speed grow, fertilizer, fertilizer, fertilizer. You just make them on the bench. Okay, okay. All that time looking for things, looking for ways to make fertilizer. And that was all it was. And the first one I can make is actually out of bone or plant material. Which is quite nice. Hmm. Do I have any potatoes down at the moment? I don't think I do. Oh, these three are potatoes, but I need more. So we need a total of 10. And I'll need to make 10 fertilizer, which I've actually got enough mist crystals for. Thank you, Bituin. Should have known it would be you. I'm happy now. Totally happy. Such 100% happy. Happy, happy, happy. But I would like some potato seeds so we can get going on this. Um... Potato seeds, let's do like another nine of them. I'm gonna put an entire plot in. And then we can plant the potato seeds with the gold and stuff. And then we can go to the desert and I can find some dead wood. And we can try and make that into flames and the thing in the alembic. So I think we have like everything we need to do the things that we need to do now. Which is kind of what I wanted to do this episode. I was getting frustrated because I was like, I don't know how to make fertilizer. Girl. Also, this Alembic is taking forever. So the wood turned just into normal earth fragments. So I think I'm going to need to go and get some stuff. I think I need to do a, a bit of an inventory tidy as well. move as much as I can. Tidy. And we'll take back the things that we want. So I always want stone. I'm going to want all of my seeds. Did my potato seeds go in? Did I not buy the potatoes somehow? Oh. Were they in? No. So confused. I think I probably didn't properly buy them. Just super annoying. I want clay. I'm keeping things for the. I could sell the eggs and the potato and the milk. I want to keep the mushrooms and the wheat, don't I? Mushrooms and wheat for the pasta. The rest can just stay in there for now.
No, there wasn't any overflow, so I think I've just messed it up. And I think... I think she closes at like three. So I think I've messed that up for the day completely. Um, so the carrot, the potato, the eggs, and the milk get sold. And the honey mushroom, I think. Uh, and then I'm going to plant all of my seeds. And then we'll make some more pastas. I've actually got room to plant them without... No, come back out. <laughs> I need you. Don't run away. Okay, so wheat should grow now. We've got the right time of year. I'm making so many mistakes here, but I'm learning like all the time how to do better. But yeah, I remembered like Bitchu and having something like farm something or other. And I was, I thought it might have been like fertilizer. And when I saw it was farm additives, I was like, oh yeah, 100%. Maybe I just fill that one in, I guess. And then I probably need to get rid of the ones down here so I can plant new things. I need to do that with the hoe, don't I? Sad times really, isn't it? That gives me back my plots. And are we still making metal fragments over here? We're not, and we should be, because uh, if we can make enough, I can start making proper, nice, big sprinklers. I could do with getting like the biggest sprinkler recipes, I think, as well. Okay, so the next thing I want to do is the cooking of the wheat into flour. And that will do us for our mushroom pastas. And sell. Or try not to press T and accidentally eat it. I'd love to have at least one thing done by the end of the episode because there's so much stuff that I've been trying to work out how to do rather than actually getting done. The Alembic is great, but I need to go, I think I need to go to the desert and get a whole bunch of stuff from the desert, a whole bunch of desert wood, probably and pop that through or maybe some desert rocks maybe the sa all the sandstone and limestone I've been getting would be something to put in there should we give that a, that a go? I think that might, that might work we're trying to do a lot of things all at once and uh, it's kind of like a bit overwhelming to try and do everything so if I just work on these mushroom pastas for now that will be fine One mushroom pasta done. Oh no. I was trying to see it, um, just in case you wondered what I was doing there, I was trying to see if I could put two in at once and we could do a bit more of a... A bulk order, but no, I don't think bulk cooking in this is going to be a thing. <laughs> Sadly. Which means I probably won't cook an awful lot. I'll maybe cook a couple of dishes at a time. Just to give myself some more, like, stamina and things. But I don't think I'm going to be doing a ton of cooking. If it's this annoying. But like I say, it might, I might find out when I get to some of the better and bigger stoves that they work in a different way. Or maybe we'll allow you to do multiples or something. 
So I can't say that it's the whole game. I can just say that this particular stove I will not be doing a ton on. Lovely. Right, I think that might be enough mushroom pastas now. So that's another six on top of the four that I did yesterday. I'd like to fertilize the three mushroom, the, sorry, the three potatoes that I've got down already. So we may as well do that and then we'll need another six after that. So let's go with six bones needed. Wow, okay. Fertilizer that one, two, three. Beautiful. And then I'll need another six tomorrow. Let's see if I can make any more at the moment. I don't have enough plant material. I can make the bone fertilizer. But then I won't have enough bone for any more. Speed grow. Uma cap, agar cap, new glow flower, lots of things that are probably from the mushroom forest will help with the fertilizer, which makes sense. I think that's the next one to open up. So we're going to need to boof a few of these. See if I get some plant fiber out of it. In the meantime, why don't I go and get some stones that I've gotten from the forest, uh, sorry, from the desert, and see if they will make me any fire fragments. So why don't I start with limestone because it's less expensive. <laughs> I can sell sandstone for quite a lot of money, so I'm, I'm loath to try and make things out of that as much. But let's pop that in and see what we get. Because it comes from the desert, I think there's a good chance that we might end up with something cool, like fire fragments. Let's sell that. <laughs> Let's pretend that never happened. <laughs> so I've got one more fertilizer. We've got one potato done. Oh no, hang on. Let me just check, because I was about to ship that potato, but I think the shipping was actually for carrots, wasn't it? Oh, we need to talk to Mikan about that. Okay, I can do that. Meow 3 is shipping wheat and the obelisk was actually the potatoes. So the gold star potatoes, and I'm going to take that question mark away because we know that they're gold star now. The gold, 20 gold bars. Are we working on those? Not, no, because we don't have any fuel. I would rather put any kind of fuel in there than nothing. So let's see if we can get some wood. Uh, what have I got in here? 11 softwood. Pop that in there and we can start making some gold. Because I'm going to need 20 gold. I'm going to need 10 of these potatoes. I'm going to need a whole load of fire fragments. So let's just see how... I don't know what reagent I'm getting out of it until it's done the first one. So I guess we're waiting for that. Uh, let's go find Mikan then. Oh, unless it's too late. It might be too late to find me. I'll, I'll go and have a look in the square. I'll go and have a look. Can you tell how much happier I am now? I know where fertilizer is found. <laughs> so much happier. No Mikan over there. Uh, let's try the house. Mikan is not at home. Mikan has a fluffy chicken, though. Uh, where might Mikan be, then? In town, maybe? Nope. It's going to be too late soon. 
Oh well, I guess that'll have to be handed in next episode then. But yeah, I'm so glad that I worked out the fertilizer stuff though. Oh, that was so annoying. Wait, I think as well, the, the frustration very much lay in the fact that I couldn't check things. I was like, I had this feeling that it might have been the alchemist. And I was like, but I can't check. They're not open till Monday. <laughs> it was really annoying. So we're still working on, let me just check with what, we don't have enough wood in that one either. Or in that one. Or in that one. Okay, let's just go get some more wood. I need these things to be working. Let's just chuck all the wood we have in. Okay, let's just cut that one in half. And use that for the iron. And we'll just chuck that in this one. Okay, and we're making fasteners in that one. So we're making gold, we're making fasteners for sprinklers, we're making gold for the obelisk. Uh, and then I need loads of fire fragments. So we're gonna need to probably, I'm really, really hoping. Yes, two, okay. So what we need to do is get more and more and more stone from the, yeah, more and more and more stone. Uh, we might even need in a second alembic, but uh, more and more and more stone from the desert. Desert stuff is good. So we'll just keep that going while we work on all the other stuff, basically. Keep it going in the background. Um, if I can put limestone in, that's great. Sandstone, I don't know if that would give me more. But it's definitely a more valuable stone, so I, I don't really know. It's very valuable. It might give me more, way more her thing. I don't know. Hmm. Have to think about that one, won't we? So yeah, I'm just gonna slowly gather the stuff together to get myself more fertilizer. So we can do the meow No, so we can that is for sorry. That is I finally got the stuff together for it. So the meow task number three. I need to mine some more times. I need to wait for the wheat to grow while I'm mining. And we've done the mushroom pastas. So that is fine. The I ship it, we just need to speak to Mikan about. The obelisk, obviously, we've got a lot to do with that. And if I can catch a salmon at some point, then great. But I'm struggling to find one. Mostly because I'm not even trying to fish. <laughs> so anyway, I hope you enjoyed that episode. If you were struggling and stuck on fertilizer, then now you also know, along with me, how to make it which is wonderful. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.